Hi everyone, happy Friday. I hope you all had a nice Thanksgiving. So it's Friday, which means it's time for our weekly What is New at the Dollar Tree for the week of November 27th. 2020 so let's go shopping we'll go to apparel and accessories first they had some new cosmetic bags with the llamas they had two different ones with the llama style and then they had two different ones with the unicorn and rainbow style so those are really cute they have the zipper top they also had some new open toed slippers in pink and blue with polka dots and a bunch of their no show slipper socks they had a bunch of different colors and each one had some different designs on the top they're mostly geometric patterns um, for all of those that coordinated with the color of the no-show slipper socks they also had in some of their trouser socks or the taller trouser socks with the white blue and black and then they had the mossy oaks walmart brand extra cushion socks your work socks um, you get one pair for a dollar and they're the tall gray socks here they also had the disposable filter masks and some masks for children they're the two pack of the disposable mask um, and then they also had some of their disposable face masks that you could wash it says they're washable up to 20 times they had two two different um, ones with the minions for children they had the trolls world tour in two different styles the design is on the back of the packaging as you see here and they also had two different ones of the jurassic world um, children's mask and it says it fits age two and up they also had some more of the fashion masks for each adults they had mostly a black and white motif so they had the stripes polka dots checkerboard um, and like a chevron pattern they also had the all blue with the white stars and the white and red stripes they also had a few different ones for texans down here with the uh, cowboy and western theme which i thought was kind of cute there were four different ones of those and i'm not sure if they're available everywhere they also had over in the arts and crafts and art kits they had these um, nickelodeon packs you get a coloring and activity book it also comes with the crayons and then a sticker sheet so that was the blues clues and then they also had the toy story 4. then i found some of their paint with water books they had some bible ones and some paw patrol they also had the crayola washable color glue um, you get a three ounce bottle of those they had some metallic and watercolor pencils you get six in a pack charcoal and graphite pencils and the last minute gifts they had these holographic scratch art kits with 50 um, sheets of paper and that they also had their candle making sets so you get a glass jar you get the wick and three bags of three different scents of wax beads for each set of the candle making they also had their cutting mats restocked and some new um, sand for the um, like vase fillers. They had a baby blue, a soft pink, they had a lilac purple color, a really soft lime green, and then they also had white. And they found their gemstone um, ribbon restocked. They also had the pearl wrap ribbon in silver, gold, and the pearl. That was restocked. You get four feet of that per package. They also had these um, Christmas tree cone uh, wreath form frames. You get a 14 inch or an 18 inch height, and there were both a dollar. I found these down the aisle with the floral and like the um, craft items. I also found these large baskets of um, dried floral and these really neat glass pens with the um, inkwells so i thought these were so neat you can get them in pink blue and in green so you get the glass pen comes with this rubber um, end on it that you just pull off and then it's got this really neat glass tip you get the little inkwell and then all you do is you dip the pen down into the ink and then the ink goes up into those little grooves of the tip and it just kind of holds on there and as you write it flows down those little spirals 
to write on the paper. And you could really write a whole line before you need to dip it again, which I really liked a lot. You just kind of have to turn the pen as you go to help the ink to flow down. So I thought these worked really well and I thought it was a great price for a dollar. And again, you could get those in green, pink and blue and the pen matches the ink color. They also had some new stickers, these uh, birds with the glitter wings. They had elephants, butterflies, and then these flowers here. They had a bunch of new skeins of yarn as well. So they had two different colors of orange. One was called pumpkin. The other one was called marmalade. And they had um, a burgundy skein. They also had two different colors of yellow. One was called golden. The other one was maize. Two different blues. One was a darker blue called denim. And then they had this lighter blue called azure. They had a light gray, which was called stormy, a dark gray called night. They had this green color. It was named juniper, a light tan that was called chocolate, and this light purple, which was called royal purple. Now we'll move over into the baby needs and accessories. First up, they had some new newborn booty socks. They had little cars and lions. They also had um, their 18 to two year old socks. The two in a pack for a dollar. They had some little puppies and sports themes. You could also get little animals. They had some stars, hearts, um, the stripes, some with um, like ice cream and things like that on it. They also had these little newborn booties with the pink pom-poms. Some new washcloths, you get four in a pack for a dollar. There were two different packs of those. And now we'll move over into the health and beauty aisle. They had some new Ioni um, eyelashes over in a cardboard box on an end cap. The Wet n Wild Photo Focus Pressed Powder in several different shades. They also had the pressed powder coverall and they had um, the foundation as well as the Photo Focus Foundation. You can get those in light, medium, fair, and dark. They also had the Wet n Wild Intuitive Blend Shade Adjusting Foundation and Primer and the Wet n Wild Celebrity Concealer. And then this pack here was a concealer and highlighter. They had some new lip gloss as well. It was called Cushion. There was this um, purple color and they also had this which was more of like a mauve. I also found some new Sassy Chic nails. You do not get the glue, but you get 12 nails. They had a matte finish on them. They were all the coffin shaped nails. And then they had these larger packs. You get 60 piece and they were the multicolored ones, which was kind of neat. I've never seen the multicolored um, packs of the nails like this before. They had the Wet n Wild One Step Gel Polish in two different shades and the new color four pack of mini nail polish and those were the last minute gift boxes. They also had the Spill Proof uh, nail polish remover as well, the nail polish remover and acetone. Then I found these diamond nail accessory kits. They had these little tubes. You could get nail clippers, tweezers, and an emery board in each um, little um, tube there. I found these decorative bobby pins. You could get those in rose gold, gold and in silver and then they had some new elastics you get 12 elastics they had gray blue and red theme and then they had the three pack of elastics um, in these packs here and then the jelly band um, hair accessories you get four in a pack and they had those in pink black and in brown i also found these decorative hair clips there were two different um, ones of these hair clips and they have like a claw clip um, alligator clip style. They also had their makeup brush cleaners back out. They had those in three different colors. You could get them in purple, pink, and a teal blue. And then they had the under eye massagers in the same color. Then they also had these new facial massagers, which are battery operated, and some um, makeup mirrors that you put batteries in. So there were two different ones, and it takes two AAA batteries. They also had some Suave Coco Shea Nourishing Lotion. And then they had the Bior Rose Quartz and Charcoal Facial Cleaner. I also found the um, Bolero Facial Scrubs, the Facial Masks, and they had some new foot scrubs, and then the um, Stone Sugar uh, 
file here and it was the onyx brand i also found the onyx bath bombs and juniper and musk which is this one here called goddess and then they had the strawberries and cream sugar sugar which had the gold glitter then they had these smaller um bath sets you get a bath bomb and some bath um crystals and they had several different scents of those. I believe I found four different packs of those. And some new body wash. It was called Cherry Blossom. Some Old Spice Tempered um, Sandalwood Deodorant. And now we'll move over into the fun finds. They had these little prayer boxes that say give it to God. There was a bunch of different styles. They're really cute. They have a little miniature mechanical pencil inside. The post-it notes inside that you can write on match the box cover. And they're like a little um, tin. They all have a Bible verse on the inside, which is really cute. And I just thought those are really cute for a dollar. They also had um, some hair glitter in two different colors. You could get it in pink and in purple. And then they had their mermaid pen. They also had these last minute gift wine stoppers. You get two in a pack for a dollar. They had a mermaid tail with a flower. And then you could also get a unicorn with a rainbow. Last week I showed you they had these little booklets with a pen. You get a list pad and some post-it notes. Um, they had some new designs this week. So they had the coffee, a mandala, and another one with like flowers and things on the outside. They also had these three pack of fashion ink pens. You could get the polka dots, this floral pack. They also had one with stripes in three different colors. Or you could also get the ones with the coffee beans and coffee cups. They also have these stylus pens. It's a six in one pen. So it's like a stylus, a pen, a screwdriver, a level, a ruler. And then they had their magnetic six pack jot brand um, magnetic bookmarks. So they had a bunch of different sets of those. Those are really cute, make great stocking stuffers or gift basket fillers. So now over in home decor, they had some new candles. These were the jam candles. There were four different ones of those that so they had the orange one, which was called peach skin and mint. They also had the pink one, which is the salted watermelon. The blue one here was called Blueberry Lavender, and then the white one was called Mahogany and Tea. I also found these candles restocked. They had these a few months back. They had the little pom-pom on top. You could get it in the blue. They also have a um, white candle inside all of these. You could get the um, peach tin, the all white, and then they have the dark red. For the last minute gifts, they also have a bunch of different scented candles. So this one was called Wonderlust. They had, and that was a pink candle. And then this one was called Good Things Come to Those Who Wait. It was Hustle Island Whisper. This one was called Coconut Sunset. And then the light pink was the Woven Cabana. They also had these new packs of um, large seashells. What came with this little net bag, some large rocks. Um, for vase fillers and then these glass decorative um, little shelf uh, pictures here so there was uh, four different ones of those they have almost like the Ray Dunn look to them with the um, dark printed writing on the outside of those they have the large frames with the um, clips to hold pictures in the brown and in the black and then they also had these four pack of pictures with different sayings on the outside they have a glitter frame um, they're kind of like a shadow box style picture and then they've got um, this really pretty glitter confetti inside each one of the pictures and there were four different ones that you could get in those sets they also had their shadow boxes with the um, bank holes in the tops you can use those as like um, a little saving bank so they had aloha every summer has a story the one with the camper says adventure money and then they had the, the one that just says saving up for and you can fill that in they also had these shadow box prints back in um, you have to watch because some of them are printed backwards depending on which store i went to depending on which ones were um, printed backwards they also had these larger pictures that say sarcasm welcome out of office this one here that says coffee the other vitamin c and mondays should be optional 
They also had their large plastic love signs back in. They're about an inch and a half to two inches thick and they do have holes in the back to hang them. And they had those in the gold and in the black. Then I also found these last minute gifts frames which just sit on a shelf but you could put a picture in them they look like um uh cameras they were so cute so they had a pink blue purple and yellow one they also brought back their shaped mirrors they had a whale a cloud they had two different dinosaurs as well and they're about an inch and a half to two inches thick um and a few inches tall depending on which mirror you get so those are really cute they've restocked these love signs in the solid gold with the little hangers at the top and then they also had these two new frames. Um, they have like an easel and they had those in gold and in silver. You just take that little picture out and you can put your own picture in there. They also had these four by four frames. Um, there were several different uh, colors of those. They all had the gold trim around the outside and then they had a different color frame on the inside. So they had like white, the solid gold and then the gold with the black. They also had these four by six shiny gold frames, or you could get the matte um, gold frames as well. I also found some new pillowcases. This one says good morning with the eyelashes. It's a white satin pillowcase. They have this one that says good night and then one that says sweet dreams. Now we'll move over into the home office, home library, and teaching tree section. They had a bunch of their miniature journals and notebooks. They have a bunch of different sayings, styles, and designs on the outside of them. I believe I found probably eight to ten different ones that were stocked this week. So let's make great stocking stuffers and gift baskets. Um, for like little journal sets and things. They also had their 2021 planners out. You can get them in four different colors. They have the larger style or the more pocket um, version and then the hard back um, little versions of their pocket calendars. Then I found these two pack of lanyards. They had the pink and purple here that say good job or you can get them in the blue that says I'm a winner. I also found some new books. This one was called Hands on Nature Projects. It's a bunch of different um, projects that you can do for like science experiments and things. They also had hands on math projects and hand on art projects. And they found some new books for kids. They had the Fancy Nancy, the Aristocat, um, and a bunch of pop-up books. These pop-up books are really cute. They have the birds. It's really cute. Their beaks pop out, and you can move the book to make it look like they move up and down. They also had this one called Reptiles in the Outdoors. It had like alligators and things in there. They also had the puppies in the park with a bunch of different dogs in that one and then they had the kittens in the cafe so those were all really cute and definitely books the little ones would enjoy they had some winter books with like the peanuts characters they had toy story they also had um olaf and frozen 2 um a spider-man those were all the board books and then they also had the Disney Princess Ariel's Treasures. I also found some new desk sets in blue, yellow, and pink. They pretty much match those um, boxes and desk organizers that I showed you guys last week. They have the blue, um, the yellow has a bunch of like flowers and daisies on them and then the pink one have the roses. I also found some decorative scissors. They had I believe four different pairs of scissors with the different decorative handles and um, the sheer part had like painting on them like rainbows and things. They had their pocket size fill in books. They had words and numbers. And now we'll move over into the housewares, home maintenance, electronics. So they have a bunch of their last minute gift. They're like stylus, keychain, flashlights. There were a couple different styles of those some of them had the larger style the smaller ones with the stylus and some of them had bottle openers on them as well with the keychain i also found the two-on-one flashlight with the led light at the bottom so it's like a two-sided flashlight and now we'll move over into the party supplies they had these large birthday balloons in gold and in silver they're 25 inches long and then you get this little ribbon here that you can hang them on they also had some new confetti and then they had a bunch of candles and 
tablecloths. They had the gold and holographic look. And then the birthday candles that sing happy birthday song. They had those in four different colors. Or you can get these really pretty gold and white candles with the glitter or the gold dip. Over in pet care and accessories, they had some new pet bowls. Um, they're the two-sided bowl with glitter. They had pink and purple. I found these food mats. They're a solid plastic mat. They had those in gray and in white for a dollar. And then some new dog bones or like a stuffed dog bone. They had the buffalo plaid, um, red and black, and then some camo. Over in the seasonal items, they had a bunch of gift card holders. So these are little tins to match a lot of those like larger tins that you could use for like cookies and things. There were quite a few of these and they're hanging on those like plastic strips that they hang on the ends of the aisles or in the middle of the aisle in between different products. There's quite a few of those. And then on an end cap, they had these um, boxes sitting. And when you open it up, it's got this little box inside that you can slip a gift card in that says to, from, and what the amount of the gift card is. There was a few of those, which I thought was really neat. I liked the way that the boxes were set up. I also had some really fun um, gift boxes. I really like the ones that have the vintage style look to them. Uh, there was quite a few of those. I really like those a lot. And then just a bunch of different um, gift bags and things that also had a vintage look to them that would be um, even fun to do crafting with. They had a, a quite a few of their wine bags. Really enjoyed the ones that were the solid glitter with these extra large gift tags with different sayings on them. And then they brought back the um, tea light candle reindeer. I also found some paper straws for the holidays. They had the solid green and white, the red, white, and green paper straws. You could get the red and white. And then they also had the paper straws in the red and black buffalo plaid. Some new um, ornaments in this bright pink. And then they also had their balloons that say Happy New Year in the gold and in the silver. I also saw that they restocked their um, holiday coffee mugs and now we'll move over into games, toys, and entertainment. So they had the collectible Hatchimals, these little eggs to fill for stockings and things. They also had a bunch of these role-playing dice in a bunch of different colors. You could get them in red. They had purple, green. They had one that was yellow. And then this one was like an amber brown color. And then they also had blue. I found this Princess Uzi Goo. It's a surprise mix. They had this one. It had like a purple color to it. And then they had Jurassic Uzi Goo, which was green with these little um, foam beads in it. They also had these buckets of sand. They're kind of like the moon sand. They had quite a few colors and they were a 10 ounce bucket. They had the miniature dough. Um, in eight different colors and then they had the two in one flarp and um, I believe it was like a slime with glitter in it so it's a two pack and they have lids on both sides and you get two different colors in each pack there they also had three different sets of checker games um, in different sizes and then some new Hot Wheels for 2020 so they had the Batman um, airplane here and then some more of their Ninja Turtle cars. Last week I showed you guys they had a few Ninja Turtle cars. And I had like a bus and thing. This week I found a few new ones. So I wanted to show you guys those as well. They also had in some of their um, large pails that were a bright purple and green. They have their build your own motorbike, airplane, and car. These are really neat. Comes with all the tools and pieces you need to build those. They had um, these large bags of Lego sets. You get 48 um, blocks in each set. I found these really cute four piece pet house. It's like this little house and they got the little doors that open up and they have cats inside of them. And each pack has different color cats and each one sitting in different poses. So I thought those were really cute and would go well with some of their other little um, dolls and figurines that they have. They also had in this new pack of unicorns, you could get them in pink, purple, or um, baby blue, you get a miniature unicorn and a larger unicorn, and they're a plastic toy. 
They had these stuffed dinosaurs. There's four different ones of those. And then they had boxes and boxes of movies at every Dollar Tree that I went to this week. So I went to all five Dollar Trees this week and they all had a bunch of boxes of movies. Some of them are Blu-ray. They have a lot of cartoons and movies geared towards children. Then they also have adult movies as well as a lot of sports movies and things like the Titanic and just older movies. But I saw a lot of them had Target and Walmart stickers on the back of them. So I'm not sure um, if they were just overruns or just movies or trying to get rid of that they're not selling anymore. But uh, make sure you take a look at those. They really had a lot of the movies in this week. And that is it for today's video. Thank you guys so much for watching. Don't forget to subscribe, like, and share. And here are some other videos from our channel you might also enjoy. I hope you guys have a great week.